Hey, what's up, you guys? Sorry about my hair's wet. I, I, dry, I washed it because I'm going away for a weekend with my family. I have videos scheduled to go up, so fear not. Fear not, I have videos going up. Today I wanted to talk about mania. But before we get into that, if you're new here, hit the subscribe button, join the growing family, turn notifications on, and also hit the thumbs up button while you're down there because it really helps me out. So let's get into this. Mania is the cockiness that you believe you're superior to others and therefore act and treat them that way. The arrogance of feeling above the rules because you're special and the chosen one. Paranoia. Feeling unsafe that those in power are conspiring against you. Snapping and screaming and shouting at someone doing something that just irritated you. It can be pure elation. The best feeling in the world but the slightest thing can make you snap at any moment. I have an example of that. When I was in hospital, I was going into mania and I was manic and I was trying to go out to come and get some things to take back to the hospital, which I did do eventually, but they wouldn't let me leave because they were worried about my mental state, so I threw my phone across the room. I'm amazed it didn't break, but a mania can turn into a aggression. It's been so so agitated you physically can't sit still and then end up pacing for hours. It's like a motor that won't stop. It's when things are going fast and you've already acted before you've registered that you're going to do the, or are going you fast or are going so fast you can't keep track of one before the next one interrupts. Receiving a call from your bank about potential fraudulent activity on your card because it turns out you're busy impulsively spending. Delusional beliefs, which at times can, which at times are really even though they're, they're not can see, no one can see it, which can become embarrassing once they've passed. Putting yourself in dangerous places and situations, but it doesn't matter because you're superhuman and nothing can hurt you. Oh. Being told you're unwell, told you need medication and threatened with hospitals, although you know you're threatened. It's scaring and hurting the loved ones whilst you're completely oblivious at the time. So it's just a bit about what mania feels like. Thanks for watching this video. If you want me to do more stuff like this, let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.